Hello guys, it's Brianna, and today I'm going to be showing you guys how to make your own puffy paint. It's a video on DIY puffy paint, so yeah, this is how mine came out, and let me show you how it dries. It's a little different from actual puffy paint. It's a little more bubbly, but I still really like it, and it's squishy, so that's my favorite part. I'm sorry, there was just people walking by. <laughs> okay. So, let me just show you guys what it looks like. These are, I think these are like the cute ones. I didn't really write anything on them, but I put a nice piece of paper and a little bordering. And I just really like those. And then, this was my first try and I wrote homemade puffy paint. I mean, you could do it, but I just don't like how it came out. And then the back I wrote, made by Brianna. <laughs> Alright, well, let's go to the video. I really hope you guys like it. Okay, here's, first of all, here's what you need. You're going to probably want more than one of these because later we're going to be using this as a bottle to put in the puffy paint in. And first off is a little bit of school glue. Um, just basic school glue, doesn't matter what kind. And then you're going to want paint. You can pick whatever colors you want, just as many as you, different puffy paint colors as you want. And then next, you're going to need a spoon and a bowl you could pick more than one bowl if you want to make it easier on yourself and then shaving gel no 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 just please make sure you buy shaving cream because I made this mistake the first time you see the difference is shaving gel is small and shaving cream is a little more foamy and big so yeah make sure you buy shaving cream because it works out a lot better all right now let's get started First off, you're just going to start by putting the shaving cream into a bowl, and after you put in the shaving cream into the bowl, you're going to put the glue in. I just drizzled it on and I was finding it to take way too long, so I just decided to take the cap off and pour it in. There's no actual measurements, you're probably pretty much just going to eyeball it and see however you want it and however you like it. And then of course, you're going to mix it together. and. I really have no measurements so you just want to make sure it's nice and a little liquidy but at the same time creamy. I found out that I needed a little more glue so I poured in a little more glue to make it more creamy. And yeah, just make sure it's creamy but yet liquidy. It's hard to explain. <laughs> okay, then next you are going to be putting in the color. You can put in as much color as you want depending on how dark or how light you want it. I wanted a turquoise color and that seemed a little too light so I added more. What I found out afterwards is that the more color you put in, the thicker it will be and it will be a little harder to put into the bottle, but it will still be fine. It's just whatever color you prefer. And after this I found out that it was still too light for me so I added more color. And as I start mixing it you can see how it gets a little thicker and bubblier. So just a little harder to work with but it was still fine. It's just however you prefer. Alright, so next you c you're going to empty out your glue bottles. You could put it into a plastic bag so it won't dry out. And what you're going to try to do with the glue bottle is take off the sticker if you want. That's what I preferred. And to stick off the sticker, you're pretty much going to get a hot water. Make sure it's hot because cold water will just make it last longer and it'll be longer to take the sticker off. So you're going to get hot water and fill a a bowl with it a bowl of hot water my bad and you're pretty much going to set the glue in there and just later scrape it off it'll come right off don't worry and then after that I didn't record myself putting the actual puffy paint inside but I just got a spoon and spooned it in there and then after that since the sticker left it it's kind of sticky I just put a pit cute piece of paper over it and that's pretty much all I did and that's how easy it is so good luck guys